Welcome back for my daily report market analysis videos with me, Richard, the Penny Market Analyst at Handtech on Friday, 16th of October. Um, we're going to look at cable, which has been flying around actually in recent days. You're getting quite a lot of dollar moves, but also sterling moves where you've got the um, dollar running around on the prospects of fiscal support package, but also sterling running on the uh, Brexit trade negotiations and the positive and negative news flow surrounding that. And isn't it should be real? Should come with no, little real surprise that subsequently you're seeing quite a fluctuation actually on on cable at the moment. Those um, last three sessions are above the average true range, which is uh, I think 117 pips, and um, subsequently you're seeing this uh, market fluctuating around. Now, it is interesting that um, we've again just fallen over, not to the pip obviously, but 30 big figure to 3080 seems to be a basis of resistance forming now. Seen lower highs all in that range um, in the last three sessions falling away. But the support initially uh, at 28.45, which was last week's low, is intact. Um, and you sort of look at these momentum indicators, they've all sort of moderated around the, their neutral points. Certainly RSI flat at 50, MACD lines flat at neutral. Reflect that. Um, yeah, in terms of direction, I think obviously your news flow driven on sterling at the moment, and that's going to be pulling cable around. But it's, yeah, it's little real conviction. I think that the rally that we had in the last few weeks has just sort of rolled over slightly, and that would sort of lean towards 28.45 being tested. 28.60 was previous to that. Uh, and yeah, I just I just think that there's a very slight negative bias um, starting to occur. And you, it's interesting that 30 big figure has becoming um, not only a pivot, obviously on the on the daily chart, but on the hourly chart in the last two weeks as well. Having been a basis of resistance, it became supportive, and it's previously uh, also now recent sorry more recently has become supportive and broken below that. It should become a basis of resistance again, but. Anything above that would be struggling, I think, around the 3080 mark as well. So I think that it's just fairly classic ranging conditions. If you look at this hourly chart, isn't it? Little real conviction, um, testing the supports, resistance is a problem, and uh, just fluctuating higher and lower. So the very, very mild positive bias, I think you can say, with the market ticking 18 pips up on the day to day but it's nothing that you'd go with any conviction. So with that in mind, I wish you good luck in your trading today. Click here to subscribe to our analysis videos. Go to our website, sign up for our webinars, and click to watch Trader Talks, our videos that give you top trading ideas.